Hey, Mickey, have you noticed something? Uh, no, what is it? Have you noticed that we've been doing this for almost five years now? Wait, really? Have I made five years? Yeah, pretty much. Wow, that's been a while since it's our first review. I think I'll let go our first review because I wasn't here until the second one. True that. So, are we sure it's on the second? It's not right now, but we do have something special planned. Really? Not really. It would just do a random video to celebrate the occasion. Okay, but I think we should do something special for this one. Now, what is it? I think I should let you review this movie. Really? Yep. I mean, you reviewed the first, you were the first, you did the first episode just by yourself, and I think you might as well do it yourself then, without me. Really? Cool, I should really do that. Thank you, anyways, uh, I guess I should start this. Yeah, you should, because it's like night, really night outside, and we've been through a lot. Uh, yeah, the, yeah, the car, the car just stopped working, now we have to walk back home. Yeah, pretty much. <sighs> well, go on. Start the review yourself. Oh, well, thank you, man. I'll, actually, it's my time to shine once again. Oh, boy. It's been a while since I do this, but I'm hoping the camera actually works well, so I'll just say this. If one of my thoughts on the first Inside Out movie, I love it, okay? That's all you need to know. So, anyway, let's just get it out of the way. Here's my review. For, it's been my first in a long time since Tom and Jerry. It was, the soul was my last one. And now it is time to come back once again. And this is my review of Inside Out 2. You know what? Let's just make it simple. The story. See? Simple as that. Yep, pretty much. Anyways, I, I fixed the camera now. Well, anyway, let's story about this. So it usually takes place two years, uh, I think it was a year later after the first one in the end, because she said it was 12 and now she's 13. And now uh, we, now she's uh, having funny emotion because the purity went off. And then afterwards, you just uh, went havoc with anxiety, envy, boredom, and uh, embarrassment. So, yeah, that's pretty much how the story. And then they had to really go back and try to text everything back to normal. You might think this is like a repeat of the first movie. Well, it kind of is, but it's kind of done differently because it's not really as a repeat. Because now we have the whole gang. Well, mostly four of the gang. Because sadness is all the way at the top. You have Squire's Force. But, anyways, yeah, that's pretty much it. So, what are my thoughts on the story? I would say, yeah, it's kind of a repeat. But it's just kind of done in a different way. Kind of like what Incredibles 2 did, but it's not like fully, fully a repeat of the entirety. And I would say is that I'm uh, the, the mostly the story wise is actually just really good. And I would say it is really good. And then that's like, ignore the noises right now. So anyway, that's really all I gotta say here. It's just that for some very reason, it is, yeah, it is so goddamn amazing. That's all I need to say. And depressing especially the ending spoilers because eddie just realized oh yeah what have i done because I, I was about to give her a he didn't have like the worst panic attack out there compared to post the post spot and then yeah and obviously the dead the end because they had her friends back and then she went and then everything went back to normal so yeah everything worked out in the end so yeah that's basically what happens in the end so and everything worked out so well, yeah, that's basically how it worked out. So I, overall, I just think the story here is actually just amazing, to say the least. Well, I guess the camera moved out, but I can still say this. This is the animation. See? Simple as that. Yeah, it's kind of like that. So, anyways, uh, what am I talking about the animation? Well, I mean, it's Pixar. Do I need to say it? It's been a while since I say this. Since a while, since we don't really say that anymore. But the animation here is obviously amazing. And that's all you need to know, because obviously, um, that's how it was, what, what the hell is I going to say? Because it's Pixar, freaking Pixar. There's somehow, spoilers, 2D animation on this movie. And that's really the one character that we'll talk about the characters. Here. It's kind of not like a parody of uh, my show, Clubhouse, but it's all you need to know, because I will explain the rest of the character section, because there's really nothing for me to say here about the animation, because what the hell is there to say? It was like unique things, and we got to see the majority of the same Harry's as, but now with different art. Uh, it's because it's how different it is, and that's all you need to know. So overall, I'll just say this, the animation is just amazing. What else is there to say about it? I just realized the background music is going on in the, or outside, so I don't know if they can hear, but this is the character, so yeah, that's pretty much how it is. Yeah, weird. I can actually hear it too. So, anyways, one of my thoughts on the characters. Let's go through all of them. But we're gonna start with the first, the, the original five. Um, Joy is Joy, and funny enough, she actually compared her to so like, yeah, I think she's not, not gonna accept how everything works out in the end because it's the third act. Sadness is just there because mostly she's all the way to the top spoilers, but obviously she's just there to hide because they don't want them to know that they were that she was there all along. And then we have anger. Anger is anger, that's all you need to know. It's funny. Um, Disgust, obviously not voiced by uh, 
the the Velma creator, which probably for the best, but uh, she had acts differently compared to what she was usually. And actually, she ruined the match. I kind of really expect that. Peter obviously is not Bill Hader, which is just one name, but acts really telling. But who cares? It's, yeah, Peter is just uh, it's scary. Oh, it's scary, but somehow it's just now it's not funny ones. Exactly, is probably the um uh, how do I say this quote unquote villain of this movie. But I will say this is actually amazing for that to work because obviously uh, it's mostly how it just works to talk about because of how everyone deals with that during puberty and then we also have the boredom um uh, probably the best new character because the Br her, her british voice envy is just mostly the oh my god the, the fat girl type, type one which feels like oh my god i want to do this and then embarrassment is really just Bears man doesn't say anything until like near the end of the movie. Oh yeah, he does talk. Spoilers, by the way. You ever heard? I heard. I heard that he's voiced by the, the dark guy from Orion the Dark Witch. That was a great movie, by the way. But you know, it's weird. But whatever. Anyways, I'm uh, yeah. And then what's well, talking? Uh, yeah, Riley. It's just yeah, Riley's just Riley. It's not right. Yeah, she's just an interesting character. And then we got the the friends, which yeah, they just literally forgot about the first the, the friends from the first movie and then we went Minnesota. So. Yeah, that's kind of like a plot hole, but I'm pretty sure that's like the future, so I think he just merely forgets about them. And then we have the new one, the, the red hair girl, which people are saying, oh, there's gonna be a couple of us. Yep, it confirmed that it was false because they just want to be friends. Yeah, that's the way that she acted. Kind of assumed that. So, and that got a lot of mad. So, anyway, that was kind of stupid, but moving on. Um, uh, and then we also have the new friends, which, yeah, they're, really, you know, they're just there, I mean, uh, we yeah, act a lot, it was like, oh no, we can hear it's like, oh, sorry, yeah, no, no. But overall, the character wise, I think they hold up well. Especially the new ones, which they're actually really good, to say at least, because they are good, that's all you need to know. Okay? It's like the camera's like kidding and Tilly around over here, so. Anyways, overall, um, if you want my thoughts, then it was probably the same as Maggie's, as long as you know that. Yeah, it's pretty weird, so anyways, um, uh, okay, I was just gonna wanna say, it's just weird. Oh yeah, I just realized we forgot about three characters um uh uh the the meet the duplist which is i think uh, the one with the belts uh which is kind of like my parody of it and the video game character from the summer games fest that we saw and then in that which discuss the kind of thing so there's a new do not ship right here so anyways uh and then there was also um uh, the uh uh how do i say this um uh I think I forgot one, which is the dark one, and a few others, but yeah. So, anyways, there you go, which is gonna work. Thank you, Doug Walker. Oh, yeah, this talk show. Thank you, Doug Walker, for that. That was obviously not here, but whatever. But, anyways, um, Inside Out 2 is actually just amazing, and that's all you need to know. Because it is, I would say it's better than the first one. I would say it's on par with the first one. That's all you need to know. So, because the story here is amazing, great, the animation is amazing, and the characters are all great. So, anyways, um, that's all you need to know. So, that's my recommendation. I would just say watch it. Just watch it, man. It's good. It's just good. So anyways, what's my rating? I give it a 9. And that's all you need to know. I know about what's going on in the background lately, but let just let you know it. Just watch it. It's fucking great. So anyways, I think it's time for me to go back to, well, I usually deal with these reviews and just relax. Well, looks like my work here is done. Now we're back to normal. Yeah, pretty much, except we're on the opposite sides, but whatever. So anyways, now what? We're just gonna prepare for our fifth anniversary special? Yeah, pretty much. We're not gonna do on that day. I don't know, and we'll just find out later in the future. Are we gonna be like Doug Walker's uh, special like we just mentioned? Probably, but we'll see. Okay about that, I hope it's not disappointing. Probably will. Yeah, good point. <laughs>